Hello everyone, welcome to the part 4 of my tutorial videos. In this part, we are going to finish the rest part of the chair, the board, sitting board, and the connection between the board and the armrest. First of all, I want to finish a little detail on the legs of the chair. So in the picture, you can see the leg is twist, twisted a little. Okay, it's really easy. You can just use the age, the lines filter and select the age and turn around and then select the other line, structure line and rotate a little bit and check out and by the way you can give the leg a fillet just insert a loop line and perfect now in order to make the other leg have the same rotate you can just delay delete this the other side part and I'll select this part and use the mirror order in standard right now and make this two parts whole okay finished so this little detail is best done right from the start because if you have built the board the armrest will be connected and the mirror tool won't be easy to be used as it was at first now we can insert loop line in these two positions okay finished and then we can connect these two little faces and this is the basic shape for for the chair to drag the board out but before we drag the before we build the board we still have to insert two loop line on this on this ship. Okay, select this two structure line and drag out. I a little bit difficult, but no problem. So we can use this face press control and drag a part drag the first part of the board out and then repeat this operation two times okay second part and the third part and now we got the basic shape of the board and now you can try to imitate the look of this part in the picture you can drag this edge down and to make the board a little bit thick and now you have to connect this board to the hind, the, the hind leg So still use the uh, insert tool to insert four line nearby the edge of the board. And now I would like to show you a very useful usage of the connect order. You can select these two faces up and down and now you got a perfect tool. You can delete these two face and now how can we connect this two parts and I suggest we can use the stitch tool but before we use it we have to delete the two faces on the hind leg and click the button drag the points on the first edge to the points on the second edge 
Oh no, I lost the fourth point. I don't know how why I can't select this. Hmm. Okay, all right. I think I have to repair this order. And from the other side. Okay, the first one, the second one. Okay, now it's, I still got a visual of the other other points. The third one and the fourth. Okay, perfect. Now just repeat this order to the other side. This order is easy to to use, but you always make little mistake. Okay, finally, the connection is finished. Still not finished. Okay, right now finished. Okay, check it a little bit. Not bad, I think. Okay, this surface two rounds, and we can insert a loop line on the hind leg at this position. Okay, now it's look better. And you can see we still got many problems of detail. Mm, we can adjust a little bit. We can adjust it right now, but don't do too much. I mean, don't fall in it. Just uh, fix a little bit problem and finish the model as quickly, as fast as you can. As I said before, all of the just work you can do at the last. Okay, I think not bad. Now let's let's pay attention of the last work, the last connection. Okay, first we can drag I we can zoom the zoom the face of the bar a little bit in and then insert loop line on the armrest in order to make the stitch face or the port face I don't know how to, how to say that the, the face to to be connected Okay, select this phase, first phase and second phase, and now enter. Okay. Mm, it's, naturally it's too, too thick, it's, it's, this connection is too fake, so insert a loop line in the middle and then zoom it in a lot. And I'll adjust it. Adjust it very quickly. Don't fall in it. Uh, on the top size, it's not so good. Drag it out. Ah, uh, okay, on the top view where you can see here is too thin, so zoom it out. And I believe we still need a structure line on the on this piece. So use frame. Mm. Face a little problem, but it won't bother. 
just you can just use uh, slide slide order uh, select this this point or this vertical and drag it to the middle of the line and now you can zoom it in and to imitate the look of the image okay press tab mm. not bad not bad uh, I think here should not uh, should not finish still zoom zoom it in a little bit this part too okay okay I should stop I should stop the for me the adjust uh, adjustment work is too attractive <laughs> just cannot stop okay I think it's sane enough uh, but maybe too sane so make it a little bit thicker mm -hmm. okay not bad and you can see here we got a little bit bloat bloated here's a little bloated so just drag the f drag the vertical no not vertical the structure line a little bit a little bit down to make the distance between the structure line a little bit more far mm, now you can see the bloat is gone the bloat is gone okay check out now we can delete this two face and now we can use a mirror order yes very classic tool in standard rhino and i'll put it on the other side and make it all make make them whole okay now the chair is finished at first but as a lot of detail should be fixed should be adjust and we will f finish all of the work at next part see you